please, let me do the dishes. That's the least I could do. I'm crashing here. Crashers clean dishes. Your family. Besides, if they're not clean the right way, David becomes a big baby about it all. I'm a pro at this point. Well, then tell the big baby to get in here and wash them himself. It's not a big deal. Nah, I know you don't mind, but I, I won't be here for too long. Just, you know, gotta get back on my feet a little. You're right. I don't mind. But David does. Is that it? Maybe a little bit. No, actually, forget I said that. Uh, that wasn't for me to... Just forget it. Sorry. He's always talking about how I'm never around, and then when I'm actually here, he acts like he doesn't know me. It's complicated. But look, he loves you. You're his brother. He's got an odd way of showing it. So where do you think you'll go? Don't know. With what happened, I'd be amazed if I could get a job assistant coaching T-ball. You'll land on your feet. Well, here's hoping. I could use a fresh start. Uh, I'll, I'll probably just travel around, you know, see what's out there. Want to take me with you? Well? Uh, sure. Just finish up with those dishes and I'll bring the car around. <laughs> but I pick the music. <laughs> yeah, never mind then. You know I'm just messing around, but it's hard to say no to a fresh start. I always wanted to go to Norway, see the northern lights. You'll be jet-setting, and I'll still just be here. Oh, god damn it! Oh, Ooh, shit, quick, shit, run shit, underwater. shit, shit! Well, that was Steven's army glass. Oh, he's gonna be so pissy about it. I can hear him already. Oh, it's so annoying. He should be more worried about you slicing your hand open. He should be. There you go. See? Much better. What was that noise? Guys! You're... You're gonna be okay. Hello? My CEO gave me that. And unless you want to dig up his fucking corpse, he's not going to give me another well, why one. Why don't we get an actual dishwasher? Oh, here we go again. Then you won't be on my ass anytime there's a spot on a fork. Excuse me? If we could even afford a dishwasher. You're both overreacting, okay? It's not that big a crisis. Stay out of this, Javi. We don't see your ass for a year. A year. Then when your life goes to shit, we're expected to drop everything and roll out the red carpet. All for Prince Javi. And now you're gonna start telling me how to talk to my wife? This isn't about him. Really? He's the one standing right there judging me for something he doesn't understand. You don't know him like I do. Always judging everyone. Except himself. You know what? You're right. It's none of my business. No. It's not. I'm sorry about the glass. Really. It's fine. It was an accident. Don't worry, I can handle him. He's just in a mood. Trust me, it won't last. Hey, take it easy. What happened? They got away. Oh god. Mariana. I already dug a grave for her. Thank you.
will never forget you. You were a good sister to Gabe. And... and like a daughter to me. Javi... Thank you for staying. I think you probably saved my life. I couldn't leave you alone. That's because... you're a good man. I'm not good enough to save her. You bought your people time, though. That counts for something. Hey, hang on a sec. She carried this around for years. I'm sorry I never found you those candy bars. You deserved just so much more life. You should have been the one burying me. Except someday. Someday far away. You did everything you possibly... The other guys had this too. Oh, shit. What? Well, what's wrong? Clem? I've run into these guys before. Who are they? Please? They call themselves the New Frontier. They used to be decent people. Now they're something else. This brand they have. It's like an initiation thing. I was kind of stuck in their camp for a while. Not by choice. It was bad. I'm lucky to be alive. What do you mean, stuck? Were you a prisoner? I got out. That's all that matters. They left one of their cars behind. That's something, at least. Good. Just like you always wanted. I can take you back to Prescott, make sure your family's okay. But then I'm hitting the road. You should stay with us. Let's just get back to Prescott.
You're back. How's Kate? Uh, she... Just came out of surgery. Eleanor's still with her. You'd best get over to the infirmary. He made it back. She asked for you. You know. I got here as soon as I could. Those guys didn't go down without a fight. And then... Mariana. I managed to stabilize her. Those bastards did her one favor, at least. Any lower, and that bullet would have torn her stomach lining as well. Your boy Gabe. He seems really fierce. He wanted to help so badly. He practically forced me to let him stay. That's Gabe. But she was bleeding so much, he... got overwhelmed. So when's she gonna be up on her feet again? She's stable. For now. But she's still bleeding inside. I don't wanna lie to you. It's probably just a matter of time. I... I wish I could do more. Thanks for trying. And for not sugarcoating it. Wish I had something better to tell you. But I'm sorry, Javi. I'm going to get cleaned up. You may want to find Gabe. He looked pretty upset when he left. This isn't going to make him feel any better. Still. I'll track him down. I know Trip drove like hell to get Kate back here. How's she doing? Not great. As well as can be expected. Yeah, considering. You should have come back with us. Your family, they needed you. Clementine needed my help back there. She could take care of herself. Your family, they were the ones who needed help. It's a hell of a situation. Just know I'm praying for you. All of you. And whatever happens, you all are welcome to stick around in Prescott. If that's what you want. Nobody's gonna force you, but we'd be glad to have you all here. Not gonna make a decision like that without talking to Kate, so... I'd rather check in with her when she's feeling better, you know? Sure thing. Let the lady weigh in first. Flew in a plane just like this to a baseball game in Arkansas once. Lifetime ago. Hmm. Doesn't look super sturdy. Hey. Have you seen a kid come through here? Blood all over his hands. Dark look on his face. Get it off that way, without saying a word. If I were you, I'd give him some space. Just my advice, one parent to another. He's had a really bad day. I can't let him go off by himself. Not right now. Sorry to hear that. That blood, I take it that wasn't his? His stepmom's. You gotta stay strong for her. Do whatever it takes. Know if my friends seen we in the same situation, I'd fight like hell. 
Anything we can do to help you out, just let me know. I, uh, appreciate that. Your boy stomped off towards the front gate. Gabe? Gabe, come, come on. Look at me. I want to go back and bury Mariana. We buried her. It was... peaceful. How could it have been peaceful? There wasn't anything you could have done. And Kate, she needed me during her surgery. She needed my help. I just ran away like a stupid little kid. You're right. You should have stayed. Kate needed you back there. I needed you back there. I know. I just... I just lost it. That's not an excuse. Not anymore. I'm done feeling this way. Feeling... powerless. I can't be some helpless little boy anymore. I need to be a man. Just like my dad was. He knew how men were supposed to act. Hey, I'm the one who's supposed to take care of you guys. Yeah, and look what a good job you did. Next time, I'm not gonna sit back and watch. I'm gonna do something. I have to. Listen, Gabe. Shit. Get inside, now! 